everybody, my name is Dottie and we are in Lima, Peru. So we missed our flight home last night and we are in Lima for an extra day and we are at our favorite restaurant. This restaurant is called La Mar Semicheria. It specializes in incredibly fresh seafood. This is our third time here and Lenza is just as excited as if it were his very first time. That's the first flight that I missed that I'm actually happy about it. <laughs> A little pisco with maracuya or passion fruit to get started. Pisco is the national drink of Peru, so it's very important that you consume many of these when you're here. This restaurant is definitely a little bit fancy. You get a lot of well-dressed families dining here, uh, businessmen taking long, leisurely lunches. And the menu, it's a little bit on the pricier side, though if you're coming from somewhere like the US, it's not too bad so the average ceviche dish will run you about 10 to 15 us and then bigger entrees are between 20 to 40 us but in my opinion it is completely worth it and you're gonna see why soon enough those are some seriously good looking scallops so these are grilled scallops seasoned with butter. You can see that's what's sizzling there and it smells incredible. And it's served with garlic and pepper. Talk about aesthetically pleasing food. Let me grab one of these and just show you the inner workings. Get a nice bite with all the ingredients. man and the most fun part you take the scallop shell and chase it drink the butter that's left mm. my god that is so good the scallop is so fresh it's perfectly grilled that butter adds like a fatty richness and then there's a kick that comes in after a little spice and then the acidity from the lime Man, that is absolutely perfect. So freaking good. This is some serious food porn right here. Mm. They know how to cook some seafood. They put so much care into everything they do here from the freshness of the ingredients to the presentation. So the table next to us just ordered this incredible looking fish. So it's baked in a stone oven with hot charcoal, lots and lots of hot charcoal. And the fish is first covered in herbs and then they put mud and salt around it and then it's baked that way in the oven until it gets that nice crust. And then at the table, the waiter removes it and it's a whole fiesta, it's just really cool. <laughs> Up next is this incredible ceviche. It's served in a chili cream and it's fresh fish, it's their catch of the day. What is it called again? Perico. I'm gonna give it a shot. Mm. That is just incredible. The sauce tastes a bit citrusy. It's got a tartness and it also has a slight mango hint as well. So it seems like a mango citrus, light chili blend. It's incredibly delicious, incredibly flavorful. And that fish, it's a really generous piece and it's so fresh and soft. It's just, it's out of this world good. We've actually had this one before and we couldn't get enough. So of course we came back for more. And also how aesthetically pleasing is all this food? And it tastes just as good as it looks. Like I swear to God. It's so good. Mm. Peru is super famous for its ceviche and it's really not hard to see why. The star of the show 
the scorpion fish Nikkei style. So Nikkei is Japanese Peruvian fusion and this is a fried fish with this very fragrant sweet chili sauce. You can see it's covered with chopped garlic, a little bok choy, and it's served with a nice little side of fried rice. Again, this scorpion fish, she isn't pretty, but you're still attracted to her anyway. You still want a piece of that. <laughs> the meat of the fish has been pre-cut into cubes, breaded, and fried. Mm. Mm. The breading gives it a really nice crisp, but it's not oily at all. And then once you get through the crunch of the breading, it gives way to perfectly tender white fish. It's sweet at first, but now it's giving way to a little spice. It's really, really good. Mm. So good. Let me try a little bit of this fried rice, actually. There's little chopped up pieces of broccoli stem, some bean sprouts. Mm. Yeah, very simple. Not crazy flavor. The perfect accompaniment to this, which is bold and definitely a flavor statement. I just absolutely love the variety. Like here we have fried fish, we got fresh ceviche, grilled scallops. I've seen people here eat these massive two-tiered raw seafood platters with urchin, scallop, shrimp, just every type of seafood you can imagine. They just do everything so great here. <laughs> Beautiful scorpion fish. Apparently some of these have venomous fins and they live among rocks. Oh, look at that tongue. Oh, <laughs> let's see the tongue. Oh yeah, get it in there. <laughs> Spicy. Mm, that was good. <laughs> okay, we're looking at the dessert menu now. And this coffee is so good. It's just a simple coffee with milk. But even that they do with so much care. Smooth, rich, like a perfect dark roast. Capping the meal off with a little something sweet. We got a little cheesecake and they've given us some fresh fruit jam to put on top of it. The jam has blueberries and strawberries in it. And I got a nice, well-rounded bite. Oops. Mm. Oh, the perfect way to end an amazing meal. Thanks so much for watching this episode of Dots on a Map in Lima, Peru. We really hope you enjoyed it. It was really, really, really good. One of our favorite restaurants anywhere. If you liked the video, please hit the subscribe button below and we'll see you next time.